welcome back to my channel. I'm back with my sisters, Naomi, Wendy. So, an update on their weight loss. They have been on this weight loss for a little bit over a month. If you guys are new to my channel, these are my two sisters. They have been on a weight loss journey before. They gave up. They are back. So, we're here to give you guys an update on how they're doing, how they're feeling, what changes have they noticed. It's a lot of you guys are going through the same thing they're going through. Every time they come up to me and tell me this is this or I feel this or that, I know exactly what they're feeling because I was there once. If you're new, I did lose 100 pounds, so I pushed them to know that it is possible to lose weight with no diet pills because they have not taken any diet pills. They have not been following any extreme diets, nothing. They have just been eating better, making little changes slowly, and they have been kicking ass working out. They do have videos um, working out. I think I posted one like a few days ago. And they just work on full body weight training. They love weight training. Um, they do a little bit of boxing and they don't have a gym membership. So that just shows that it is possible to lose weight with no gym. Um, I started off at, I don't remember if it was 203 or 205. Um, basically the same weight that I was before. I have lost it but I gained it again because I decided to give up. But um, the second time I started doing it again, I felt more motivated. Um, I really did. Like I would push her sometimes to even work out. Like I would be like, oh, let's go work out. And she was really surprised. Yeah, but once I started to see her, like, really, like, asking me, oh, are you going to work out today? And, like, on me, I'm like, whoa, like, she's being serious this time. Because they tell me, oh, any help, I want to lose weight, and I'm there for them. But I'm not sure if they really want to. They're just, you know, they're just doing it for the moment. But once she started to tell me and push me and ask me, then that's, that's when, okay, she's being serious. Okay, I'm going to help her. I'm going to be there for her. And sometimes, honestly, I didn't feel like working out, and I just did it for her. And then I feel great after because right now I'm really proud of myself because like it's been a month. It hasn't been that much time like for me to lose a certain amount of weight. Like I thought I was going to lose more but obviously you can't expect a lot to happen like fast. But I started off as 203 I think and now I'm 189. So it's been, I've lost a little bit over 10 pounds and I'm really proud of myself because like at first I was like oh I'm out of the 200s and then I was like I'm out of the, like 190s. And I'm 189 now, um, so I'm really proud of myself because also because I was also really lazy. I never wanted to work out, yeah. but she's doing really good, and I know she's gonna get really really far. And I'm like people are noticing now. She's getting compliments yeah. of like, "Whoa, you can tell like what are you doing?" So that yeah. really and also like looking back every time like I look at old pictures of me and how I was, I'm like, that's what inspires me more just looking at myself and how I was and how like a few pounds really do make a difference it could be probably the smallest things but they make a difference and I'm just really proud like that inspires me a lot like looking at myself and also her I just like that's why like I do I've been lately this past week I've been like not really motivated but then I think I'm like wait I have to do it like I get myself back on track and I start working out again I look at pictures and that's what motivates me and sometimes she just complains to me like oh my god I haven't had a chance to work out for two days and I feel horrible I feel like I gained five pounds and I understand because I feel the same exact way but I just tell her it's fine you're not gonna gain weight by not working out today just make sure you're eating good sometimes they don't have the food available but you just have to make the best of it you can't just you don't have food so i'm just gonna eat whatever because i don't have what i what i should eat so she is a different kind of story she does not weigh herself as much but you can tell like a difference <laughs> this morning <laughs> this morning we we're comparing pictures and it's just amazing because i would ask them at that point did you know you were that they you know that you were that overweight and they would be like no yeah. because at the moment you're comfortable like you don't realize until you start making changes and you're like whoa like it looks like i was like a balloon or something <laughs> so i i think that when i look at my before pictures i'm like whoa who blew me up <laughs> well let me just say something for her at first she's it's like, my turn no but she wasn't really doing it hold on she wasn't really doing it. then i was the one that kept asking them like oh like you guys want to work out if you guys want to you can go ahead if not like it's fine but she 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 always always said yes to me like every time i asked she's like yeah yeah i'll work out i'll work out like i think for her it's better it's, to yeah. have someone to work out yeah, with. yeah because when i'm alone i just i'm not motivated at all and then that's why i always work out with her because with her like i don't know it motivates me i think it's more like when you're like working out else. alone you're like well no one's watching me yeah. i can just like play off and when you're working out with some someone is that like you want to com compete with them 
like uh, she can do it, I can do it too, you know. And then their sister so you know, they want to be better. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <right>. no. <annoying. laughs> so she's also like she's really strong when it comes to boxing. Like she can be your ass. Up. So you gotta watch, watch out. out. Watch out. And shout out to all you guys that follow us our Instagram. We're gonna start posting more. We just like you know we're. Trying and to get still and they're to getting that. into cooking too. They we like to eat chicken a lot. Chicken, <laughs> broccoli, a lot of broccoli. So I love broccoli. I like basically Shabbos. we eat the same things, but like I don't know. I'm, I'm really satisfied with it all yeah. the time. Like and I'm trying to show them balance to have a good relationship with food, to not be afraid of food. Like if there's something and you want it, like you shouldn't feel guilty if you have a little bit of it, but you have to know what how to control yourself not eat until you're so stuffed that your stomach hurts and then regret it because she she's had like here and there little things right like a bite of something and then she realizes that her stomach starts hurting yeah. when she eats something like greasy that's because your stomach changes you have to have discipline to reach any goal in life it's not only necessarily weight loss but just like get your shit done that's it just set your priorities straight and every day when you wake up make a list of what you want to accomplish that day and try to do it I know they're gonna do great. I know they're gonna continue, and there you're gonna see them another update. They're gonna tell you how much more they lose, and follow them on their Rico's page. They post what they eat usually. Oh, we go know. live when we work out. They yeah. go live. I want to thank you guys for being part of our family. We love you guys so much. When you guys comment, you guys motivate. No, it makes me feel like I don't need a million subscribers to help people out. Just with the little people that I'm helping, that makes me happy. And remember, I'm just here to help you guys and nothing else. I'm not asking for anything back. So, thank you guys again. And please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And good vibes. Hey guys, my sisters are actually working out outside. But I want to show you guys how they're working out. I forgot to add in the update that we recorded that you probably already saw. They have been losing weight without much cardio. They have been doing more weightlifting, weight training, and... Oh, why is there a fly here? Um, they have been losing weight without um, a lot of cardio. They really don't go running or anything, which I do tell them to, but they don't like it. And they're losing weight. So that shows you that you don't need to keep yourself in the treadmill if you don't like it, or in the Stairmaster running. You can lose weight with weight training, and I believe this 100%. I wish I would have done more weight training when I was losing weight but I was just afraid because I would believe all those rumors of you getting bulky and big when you lift weights and it's not the case you actually lose more body fat and you burn fat while at rest so I'm gonna show you guys their workout so let's start this is the first workout is the overhead press they love this one good Now they're moved to the squat with a twist. I really don't know the name for this one, but it's really good for your lower body. And I'm over there joining since I can't do lower body, just doing some flies. Here I brought him up like a little workout. Um, it's just, honestly, I don't really know the names of them. I just write however I think they're called. So Mimi, the one in black, she's doing jump squats and she's jumping over this little thing we have. The other one's doing like a back lower body workout with the machine we have. And now they switch positions when they're doing the jump squats. I try to add little workouts like a little bit of cardio because I told them it is important for the heart and they do need to do cardio and they're going to see more results. So here they are. Now Mimi, the one in black, is doing flies. And the other one's doing a tricep workout. And they are loving the burn. And again, they switch spots. So now uh, jumping jacks for Wendy and Mimi is doing push-ups. She said, I can't do the regular push-ups. I'm going to do girl push-ups. It doesn't matter. You're going to get stronger somehow. Now Mimi is doing, I really don't know what it's called, but you basically gr grab like little dumbbells. If you don't have weights, don't worry. Grab bottles, anything you have, cans, and do the workout. Okay, so now swings, kettlebell swings. Again, grab anything you have at home and just swing it. Make sure it weighs something, obviously. And Mimi is doing the boxing one twos to get more cardio in. This is just like a total body workout. Nothing, not targeting any specific body parts. Just an overall workout. 
so we just finished our workout um we haven't ate anything we woke up early in the morning um and started working out now we're gonna since i don't really like to eat a lot i get hungry a lot we're gonna eat some right now something small one third right and so we're gonna add banana wait first we're gonna add the sugar oh yeah the sugar. this is already like the, these little packs they come already with like two tablespoons of sugar so that's what exactly what we need for the oatmeal bananas and we're gonna chop them up and put them in there put um a little bit of peanut butter this is a cookie dough protein peanut butter spread hopefully Fitzsuzy doesn't get mad because we got her peanut butter <laughs> a little bit like half a tablespoon probably not the best milk ever but we're not adding that much milk so. we add blueberries so this is our whatchamacallit lunch okay a little so bit of olive oil spray it's easier to do it in the microwave so that's what we do it's 30 seconds or less no, she's just gonna... You guys know how to make an avocado toast, I'm pretty sure. This makes everything so much better. But there it is, guys. Avocado toast. 